All right, guys, so welcome back to this video, and we're going to go over how to create the task statistics um, panel and the bootstrap table. Uh, table. So uh, let's go back to our text editor, and we want to go all the way down below our um, completion, progress, completion progress bar uh, panel. Below this one, we want to create another panel, and we're going to name it uh, panel info. Panel info. And inside here, we're going to create a panel heading like we have done. And h3 text center tasks statistics. Next, we want to create our panel body. And here, we're going to create call sm6 plus call or actually times two, times two, this will do. And here we want to create um, paragraph tag of, well, we can create four paragraph tags. So first one is going to be total tasks is equal to one. Next is going to be tasks left to do is also one. Uh, third one is going to be check marked tasks, then one, then deleted tasks one. In our second bar, we want to create a H3 tag saying total tasks one. And then in our second H3, we want to create a manageable title. And here we're going to give it a style of padding 10 pixels just for ease of uh, visibility and then we're going to give it a class of green. Now we, go, we want to go back to the styles uh, tags and then we want to create a new class called green. And here we want to create a, create a background color of spring green. So let's go all the way back down here and then let's see what we have so far. Refresh the page. And we have our task statistics and we have our tasks viewed. Finally, we want to create our table here with our one item. So let's go back to our IDE. Then below here, let's create another, uh, let's create a table tag and table with the class of table which gives it uh, basic bootstrap styling, then t head with three table headers, and then a t body, t body of tr table row, and then three table datas, like so. And then in our first table header, we want to say check mark done, because this will contain our column for check marks. And then second column is going to be task name. And then third last column will be delete. Then we want three right here. And then first one is going to be input type checkbox. Second one is going to be go buy a fish tank. Third one is going to be button, class, button, class, button, danger, class, button, block. And here we're going to say delete. So now let's go back to our uh, browser. And if we refresh, whoops, not this one. If we refresh at the bottom here, we have our table visible. So now that we have our completed bootstrapped um, visual uh, visual tables and panels all created. In our next tutorial, let's actually get down to creating the uh, VGS. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next lecture.